To design my guitars, I use an open source software called Inkscape. Inkscape is a vector graphics editor that lets you draw basic shapes like lines and arcs. Especially helpful for guitar prototyping are the Bezier curves, which make smooth curves between two or more points. Rather than start from complete scratch, I usually start with an SVG template that I downloaded from the internet, which has both an S-type and single cut guitar shape at the proper one-to-one -one scale measurements. On import, it gives us a few choices. In this instance, I choose having a more accurate scale, since I'll be printing this out later as a template. We can click on a line segment and move it around quickly to see what results. If we want to make tighter curves, we can use the Add Node button to place a node in between the line segment. If we want to make a smoother curve, we can remove a node. You can also grab the handles to do a node rotation to fine tune your curve. For my great guitar build off design, I'm meshing a lot of pre existing design language. Using the single cut design, I added an offset like the so-called surf guitars. Bolt-on necks with six inline tuners are easier for me to build, so I'm going with that style headstock, which I took from the top template. Rather than replicate the headstock directly though, I've made it a bit more sleek and angular, and carried over those angles into my single cutaway. I'm not exactly sure if I'll keep the two volume, two tone controls, but it doesn't really matter at this stage. Once I'm comfortable with the body and the headstock, I'll print them out on my home laser printer and make MDF templates out of them. Since I'm not doing production levels of building, nor am I trying to make the parts interchangeable, I don't really worry about printing a full-size scale drawing. I'll end up hand measuring and drawing out the exact measurements for the neck and where the bridge goes to have proper intonation. And that's about it. I was never good at drawing, so taking a pencil and eraser directly to a body blank has never really worked for me. By using Inkscape, I can make as many adjustments as I'd like until I get a shape I'm happy with. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe so that you can be notified when more videos from my great guitar build-off playlist get published. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.